All right, next one. All right, next one's 60. Next one is my favorite, and I can really show off how badass I am. 16 is the first time. mandatory scheduled maintenance. The appropriate chamber for this testing sequence is currently unavailable. It has been replaced with a live fire course designed for military androids. The enrichment center apologizes for the inconvenience and wishes you the best of luck. Yeah. yeah. So these are the classic turrets. Please put me down. If you walk into their red beam, they will start shooting at you. To disable them, knock them over. And then they'll turn off. So, you can get really good at this, like I am. Where you can just do... The elk shit, no, not what I want. Ow! That's what happens when you get shot. You don't instantly die, which is a little lame. You should do kind of things to die, but that's okay. Or you can just jump and push them over. <laughs> was a little on the train. Eh, I don't think it's wrong. So this is the first time. Whoa, geez. This is the first time we find something slightly strange about the facility. This is where the classic line, the kick is alive, the kick is alive, the kick is alive, the kick is alive, the kick is alive. Hi. Hello? Can I help you? And this is where things start getting a little weird. You start getting outside of the facility and getting to have a look around. There's a pot being cooked on a computer. This is a computer. Yeah. The last guy that was here is known as uh, Professor Ratman, or Dr. Ratman. He was one of the researchers of the facility. So kind of went nuts. nuts. So I'm not going to do... Oh, wait, no, I might want to do this job. Yeah, with the help of these things. Might be easier. That's how you're supposed to do it. However, I can do this without it. Bounce! Jump! Hi. I'm just so badass with these things. They're kind of cute. They are absolute. They are absolutely adorable. I should Mother kill him with the radio. I probably will. Ow. Ow. I'm not showing off my badass suit as much as I thought it would. <laughs> and the radio 
Radio, ladies and gentlemen, is still okay. Yeah, radio's Man still here. Android, the enrichment center once again reminds you that Android Hell is a real place where you will be sent at the first sign of defiance. Listen to this. They scream when you kill them. Well. Yeah, it's a little, it's a little frightening. So I'm sorry I wasn't giving a whole lot of um, explanation on how to do that level. Knock the turrets over, basically. Put a portal behind them. If you can't do it that quickly, grab a box, put a portal above them. You can use the grab should get a good angle and just drop a portal on them. However, this is test chamber 17. This is the, the most famous test chamber in this game. Will deliver a weighted companion cube in three, two, one. This weighted companion cube will accompany you through the test chamber. Please take care of it. That's right. We, ladies and gentlemen, got the most favorite her, um, stencil box in the world. The weighted companion cube. And it will be our companion, and it will protect us. The symptoms most commonly produced by enrichment center testing are superstition, perceiving inanimate objects as alive, and hallucinations. The enrichment center reminds you that the weighted companion cube will never threaten to stab you and, in fact, cannot speak. Okay, just a quick thing, I'm going to do this. To ensure the safe performance of all authorized activities, do not destroy vital testing apparatus. For your own safety, do not destroy vital testing apparatus. Uh, this is when I stop liking this level. Well, I'm going to do the hardest one of these first, because the hardest one is likely the easiest one to actually get through. First things first, I'm going to show off another Ratman death. That's what these are referred to as, the Ratman death. Where Professor Ratman hid. Oh look! There's busted things everywhere. So let's read some of this. I have no idea where to start with that. <clears throat> All I know is that they've taken the Girls of Aperture Science, September 1983. Girl, companion cube, companion cube, companion cube. She's watching you. Let me companion cube, companion cube. Look at all the. Where did you get the camera? Companion cube, companion cube, companion cube. Companion cube, companion cube. Companion cube. Stop watching. The earth and them are gone. I thought the cube would last forever. I was, I was wrong. wrong. Because I could not stop for death. It kindly stopped for me. The cube hmm. had food and maybe ammo for for immortality. Why, 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 why? Not in cruelty, not in wrath. The Reaper came today. An angel visited this great path and took the cube away. Well, shucks, that's a little really, really grim. So, yeah. The thing is, the Rated Companion Cube, everyone seems to fall in love with the Rated Companion Cube. Nobody knows why. So this is a trick. This is the hardest one to get. This is why this is the one I'm getting first. It's a pain in the neck to do. Shit, fucked it up. Sorry! Yeah, okay, so what I'm trying to do, you need to pop an orange portal here. You then need to shoot a thing through there so that it gets there. You need to get back down, remove this so it gets trapped between the two. Before it dissipates, you need to pick this up, move this, put it on that button so that it goes and hits the thing. Whoa. So let's try this again. I'm going to get out of the way. Here it comes, here it comes. Go. There we go. Now we keep the weighted companion cube with us because it is actually. I like it. It's adorable. This is, okay, so this is the next one we need to do. 
This is this is the e this is an, a much easier one. It's still the second hardest. So what you want to do is pop a portal right there. Proceed to go back to the previous area. Leave the companion cube. You don't need to bring anything for this one. Sure, I got the right one there. Yeah, okay. So it's going to go through there. It's going to bounce off that and land directly in it. So there, we now have two out of three of them. In the event that the weighted companion cube does see, the enrichment center urges you to disregard its advice. So now we have two out of three of the platforms required to continue. Now for the really difficult one. This one is more based on luck than anything. You just need to use the companion cube to bounce the pellet in there and not die. Like there is there is no skill involved in that, that's mostly luck. So now that we have all three of these done, we just move across them quickly. And jump on them. There we are, into the test chamber. Thank you, weighted companion cube. That's really nice of you. You did it. The weighted companion cube certainly brought you good luck. However, it cannot accommodate you for the rest of the oh, test and, dog. unfortunately, must be euthanized. Please nice. escort your companion cube to the Aperture Science Emergency Intelligence Incinerator. Hey. What? What was that? Holy shush. Sorry, it's just someone walking by my house. What? What? An incinerator? They want us to incinerate the companion cube. Hells no. I'm sorry, but look, look, it's the only way we progress. I'm sorry, companion cube. Rest assured that an independent panel of ethicists has absolved the admission center that pressure signs employees and all test subjects of the moral responsibility for the companion cube euthanizing. Okay, sorry about that. Yeah, no, we have to, we have to, we have to burn the cube if what we want to progress. Camera? That's a good point. Where did that camera go? Well, it has been a faithful radio. companion. No, we have to Your take the radio with us. companion cannot accompany you through the rest of the test. If it could talk, and the enrichment center takes this opportunity to remind you that it cannot, it would tell you to go on without it because it would rather die in a fire than become a burden to you. Yeah, they, they're really big on telling you that this thing isn't alive. Kind of makes you think, maybe it is alive. Or maybe there's something more to it that we don't know. So first things first, I'm going to put this here so that we can take it through later. Testing cannot continue until your companion cube has been incinerated. Okay, there's a the camera over there. Yeah, no, I, I know, there's a couple of them back there, but apparently we can't move them. Yeah, that's a good point. I've never tried using a camera. Let's try if we can use a camera. Although the euthanizing process is remarkably painful, 8 out of 10 Aperture Science engineers believe that the companion cube is most likely incapable of feeling much pain. We got a tetanus. That's 80% of it's going to go out. Nope, didn't work. I'm sorry, lady companion cube. The companion cube cannot continue through the testing. State and local statutory regulations prohibit it from simply remaining here, alone and companionless. You must euthanize it. I'm sorry, companion cube! You euthanized your faithful companion cube more quickly than any test subject on record. Congratulations. Makes you think that maybe the weighted maybe the weighted companion cubes have something inside them. People. That's the theory. That's the theory is that either the people that work at the facility or uh, other test subjects that they've gotten rid of. Well it makes sense why I put the um companion cubes over the faces of people. Yeah. Hi, Matt Pat. We're not shamelessly, we're totally shamelessly referencing your video. 